Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video we will look into the differences between orthogonal, or 2D cutting, and oblique cutting, or 3D cutting. Let's know a bit about them in advance before getting into the topic. Orthogonal cutting, which is also referred to as 2D cutting is a type of metal cutting in which the cutting tool approaches the workpiece with its cutting edge parallel to the uncut surface and at right angles to the direction of cutting. Thus, tool approach angle and cutting edge inclination are zero. Again, oblique cutting also referred to as 3D cutting, is a type of cutting in which the cutting edge of the wedge-shaped cutting tool makes an angle, except the right angle to the direction of tool motion. Now, if we differentiate orthogonal cutting from oblique cutting in terms of how we describe them. In orthogonal cutting, the cutting edge of the tool makes right angle to the direction of feed motion. Whereas, in oblique cutting, the cutting edge of the tool is inclined to the direction of feed motion. If we differentiate them in terms of components of force. In 2D cutting, there are only two components of force which are mutually perpendicular. The components include, cutting force and thrust force, and can be represented by 2D coordinate system. Whereas, in 3D cutting, three components of force are considered that is thrust force, radial force and cutting force. These components cannot be represented by 2D coordinate system, they can only be represented by 3D coordinate system. If we differentiate them in terms of tool life. The tool that uses orthogonal type of cutting has a lesser cutting life compared to tools that use oblique cutting. Whereas, the tool that uses oblique type of cutting has a more cutting life compared to tools that use orthogonal cutting. If we differentiate them in terms of heat concentration at the cutting region. Orthogonal cutting has a high heat concentration at the cutting region. Whereas, oblique cutting has a lesser concentration of heat at the cutting region. If we differentiate them in terms of cutting edge. The cutting edge is larger than the cutting width in orthogonal cutting. Whereas, in oblique cutting, the cutting edge may or may not be larger than cutting width. If we differentiate them in terms of chips flow. In orthogonal cutting, the chips flow is in the direction normal to the cutting edge. Whereas, in oblique cutting the chips flow along the sideways. If we differentiate them in terms of shear force per unit area. In orthogonal cutting, the shear force that act per unit area is high, a factor which increases the heat developed per unit area. Whereas, in oblique cutting, the shear force per unit is low a factor which decreases heat developed per unit area hence increasing tool life. If we differentiate them in terms of surface finish. The surface finish obtained in orthogonal cutting is very poor when compared to oblique cutting which gives a fairly good surface finish. Whereas, the surface finish obtained in oblique cutting is a bit finer when compared to orthogonal cutting which gives a poor surface finish. If we differentiate them in terms of their use. Orthogonal cutting is used in grooving, parting, slotting, pipe cutting etc. Whereas, oblique cuttings is used almost in all industrial cutting, used in drilling, grinding, milling etc. So, we have discussed about the differences between orthogonal or 2D cutting, and oblique or 3D cutting in details. Thank you.